five people joining us on the show today is a fashionable Nigerian heat record producer, mm -hmm, artist, songwriter, music composer, and creative entrepreneur. Ha! Five fingers up. Over the last four years, he has established himself on the entertainment scene with various heat records for several top artists. Ladies and gentlemen, we have we we we, we, we Willis. Willis. Give yeah. it. Young Willis is in the building. <laughs> Uh, uh, because wow. of you see my all my fingers waiting. I just like, like that tagline. Oh, yes, so I do. Love so it. Like when you when you want to start listening to a mm. song and then it comes yeah, up. Yeah, you ginger. Just, uh, ginger. You're already getting yourself <laughs> ready and all that. Oh, well, you. well done on all the works that you have done, all the achievements. Congratulations so, too. Thank you so much. Yeah. So I've been seeing challenge, and then I've been seeing people beating you to your own. <laughs> That's that's the that's the the point. <laughs> the point. <laughs> yes, they should they should get they should get yes, to beat me. Yes, I get it. I yeah. get it. So that is the given. But I'm challenge. not seeing your own video though. Ah, ah. I can't even dance. <laughs> <by you. laughs> I can only abuse people. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm hoping, but, but I hope you'll get your own video. I'm though. sure that as people are beating, if if we do it together, they'll say, I don't even want to do it. I don't want to get it right. At all. <laughs> why, 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 why that tagline? Yeah. Um, so it happened back in university. I've said this so many times. Yeah. Um, a friend of mine, your boy Toby, that's his name. And I had like a small setup in school then. And he came into my studio I had then. And he was like, we, we. No, he said, when is Gideb? Uh -huh. And then, Sweet Boy, the song Sweet Boy was yes. where I did the we with like the uh, Jack before he had to give them. But yeah, I mean, basically, he had the beat I made and he felt like giving them or Will is giving them. giving them. <laughs> you know, describe yeah. what, what he heard that day. But yeah, that's how it came about. It was yeah. really not me, it was my friend. So be shout out to your boy, too. Are nice. you paying for Oh, yes, no. <laughs> should be yes, because you in should. future, if he comes up and say, hmm, ladies Nami, and gentlemen, Nami, 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 Nami create this name. This boy is owing me. As a copyright. No, 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 no. I hope you've copyrighted your name. No, no, yes, we have. Okay, so since no, you're he's my guy, who, so oh, no, 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 uh, even guys they turn. No, 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 guys, guys, guys. Right, since you're always giving us creative, amazing beats, and many people are like, where did this guy come from? How did production start from him? How did everything start for Willis Gidem? So tell us your story. Uh, so um, basically, it's almost like the same Nigerian story. Oh, started okay. in the church. Oh, yeah. oh my God! There's another Nigerian story where you start yeah. from the gutter. From the bottom. Where you start yeah. from the gutter. Because all the Nigerian <laughs> coming out yeah, are inside the gutter. Oh, they yeah. started they from they the gutter. So it's not from top to bottom. It's bottom to top. <laughs> yeah, so I guess. But I started in the church. Um, I played drums. I played the keyboard. Mm. And from there, I just had the interest for like production. And I started producing from secondary school, actually. And then by the time I got to my university, I realized people were buying beats for me, at least 30K <laughs> there. Uh, so I was like, OK. Ah, 30K? Yeah. Nice. Wow. Yeah. So I just felt like from, for me to get to this point and where people are buying my beats, that means I have something. And then when I finished, I, when I got back to Abuja, because originally I'm from Abuja before I moved to Lagos, I noticed that people were really getting to my sound. So everybody used to tell me, bro, you have to go to Lagos. We'll go to Lagos. That's go where it's Lagos. going down. You know, and I was scared at first, but <laughs> I tell God I made that decision and I came to Lagos. And from there, I met Faust mm -hmm. and shout to Chills. He introduced me to Faust. And that's how I had my first big song, Sweet Boy and Talk. And I feel good. I feel good, you know. And yeah. then to Highway. And yeah. yeah. Then now we're yeah. jamming to give them. Yeah. 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 Interesting. Do, yeah. do, you still, do you still function in church? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very much. When ah. I go to, so when I go to Abuja, like, in my church, my pastor will call me, give them. So I still play the drums. Oh, okay. I love yeah. that. Nice. That's, That's so interesting. Great. That's so, so interesting. Uh, so uh, you've worked with um, a number of people, as you yeah. said, DJ Wise, uh, Fino, mm -hmm. Highway, uh, Faust, Paturanke, Timaya. You're like Timaya Major And now you're doing your own thing. Yeah. Now it is Nigeria to the world because of um, more movements, big one. <laughs> <laughs> the, one the, the way the world is actually paying attention to us these days, and especially with the fact that producers too are doing greatly mm -hmm. uh, because look at Rihanna's um, Beyonce's work mm -hmm. and uh, some people actually a, a lot of Nigerians actually yeah, uh, some Nigerians got, got accolades and all of those 
I mean, what would you say about this Afrobeats to the world? And um, what are your expectations, uh, especially with the fact that they are even created, creating some special categories mm -hmm. for people when it comes yeah. to awards, big awards? Yeah. Uh, where do you see yourself? Well, like, I would say I see myself um, next, four, let me say three, four years, in that big global stage. That's where I see myself um, working with the likes of Drake, Chris mm. Brown, and the rest. But yeah, I would say Afrobeat right now is, is in a big space, and a lot of things are happening for not just the artists as well as the producers. So I would say, yeah, I'm very hopeful. I'm yeah, very, because very, very, yeah. Very it feels ability. Yeah. 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 I mean, that's, that's very, very inspiring because, like, nobody saw that coming. Yeah. Oh. And everybody now, they just let everybody know that Afrobeat is actually up. So we're next. We're just yeah, going to you're play going home. places. Fantastic. <laughs> yeah. All right, now we'll go on this quick break and we still have... We, 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 We still have superstar hits record producer Young Willis in the building. Thank you so, so you've much. been giving them. And, yes, wait, and then? everything is just sweet and interesting. <laughs> so, so let me start with your fans. Your fans, I found out your fans are called the Givers. Yeah. <laughs> Who came up with that name? <laughs> Of so them. I came, no, 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 we had that before the song. I oh. went on Instagram Live and I was like, um, so guys, I think we need to have a name. <laughs> and then people, some people say, suggest that Yeah, stuff. some said uh, giving them gang. Uh -uh. Some, and then someone said give us, and I was like, wow, give that's us. it. And then give I was asking laugh. everybody, and everybody <laughs> said, yeah, give works. us was nice. Wow. All right, so let's talk about this colorful video we just saw. Right. Really, really amazing video. Thank you so much. Uh, we've seen that you've worked with. Timaya on several occasions. So of mm. all the artists, why did you choose Timaya to work with? And then why the Kabusa Choir? So the song, the chorus, we least you've been yeah. giving them. It was by Timaya originally. <laughs> when Abuja, yeah, I went to go and see him in Transcorp. And immediately I go into his room, he was like, we least you've been giving them. Hey! And immediately he said that. I was like, okay, I can talk. turn this thing to a song. Oh, yeah. wow. So I was like, let me try and be creative. So I decided to put the choir. Mm -hmm. And shout out to Kabusa Choir. Mainly I sang the idea to them. They were like, ah, don't worry. And now, they it. now I sound I, I am telling you, I, yeah. I love it. Yeah, love so it. Much. What space? See the way this one is looking at me. I want to talk to everyone. Okay, now let's talk about thank your you. record label. Okay. Because I see that you now have a record label. Yeah. And I was just wondering, because, you know, these days, uh, we, in fact, so we've discussed this here before. Mm -hmm. uh, we're actually talking about, must everybody have a record label in Nigeria? Because in other clients, it's not done like that. No. Like, you can have artists who mm -hmm. don't even think of having a record label. They are comfortable yeah. being under, under yeah. another yeah. record umbrellas, label, yeah. you yeah. know? And it can even be branches, like <laughs> you have, um, you know? Uh, yeah. And so, I just wonder, why? Why? Why, why did you decide to have a record label? So, um... For me, basically, I want to start small, and then eventually it's bigger than me. I also feel like as a producer, like part of the reason is that I'm going to sign artists as well okay. and help people and then, you know, let them get to hear their sound. So I wanted to start my, my own way and then gradually then we sign other people. But the reason why is because of structure. For me, I strongly believe in structure, you know, like everything you want to do, if there's no structure, then... It's not gonna really, really happen, you know. Mm. So if I say, for instance, I get like producers, even, not even just like artists, sound engineers, music producers, mm. and I bring them, and I'm like, okay, guys, let's be working. And there's no structure. Mm. It's not right. Or if a company wants to work with me or partner with me, I have to come correct. So that's one of the reasons why I had to do that. Okay, talk, talking about structure, let's talk about um, this usual producers, artists, drama. Okay, maybe I'm, never I, maybe, maybe I'm poking my nose. What, what's your split sheet like? Do you collect, it's yours like collecting royalties after yeah. producing the song or you just give me the money for the beats? What do you want to do? They go, <laughs> this is me poking my business. No, no, no. Poking no, no. my nose into Willis' no, no. business. So I personally, I don't know about the producers. Okay. I always get my payment and my royalties because your royalties is like your, your retirement. The retirement, yes. Yeah, yeah, it keeps so coming. It keeps yeah. coming, yeah. you know, yeah. and it's not, I don't think it's smart. I'd rather you even give me royalties than even giving me physical cash. So I wear when they pop, they go, you see, yeah, collect yes, from now, KYS. We'll yeah. cash <laughs> At least that one be keeping us well. So yes, and our all together. Have yeah. you ever thought of having an acad academy, like training people? Yeah. I think I, think I can, but <laughs> I want to grow into it. I don't think I should rush into it. 
I want to grow into it. And when I feel like the time is right and I have the right resources, mm. you know, then I can now say, okay, I want to open an academy. Okay, after, yeah. after giving them, what's, what's... Okay, so <laughs> we'll keep giving them. That's what is okay, always after giving be. them video. Yeah. After giving them video. <laughs> we'll keep giving them. Yeah. The giving is endless. But yeah, no. what's next is um, I have my project coming for. Uh, it's called LOTP. Who can guess? Who can guess? Who can guess the name? LOTP. Yeah, yeah. Guess, guess what it means. Lord of the. Lord of the. Lord of the. Lord of the. <laughs> Lord of the. <laughs> what is LOTP? It's life for the party. Oh, oh my God! Why wow. did you write it like that? Why? Uh, Why? Uh, and I saw it somewhere. Uh, Actually, uh, Why? Why? So, so life for the party. Yeah, we're dropping life for the party soon. Soon you guys are going to be hearing me doing a lot of things and Any not just production. Any Yeah, we do university tour. Okay. We, I okay. believe that, yes, it's very important for me to go around. That's right. You know, that was where it started for me in my university, oh, wow. so I feel like it's very important for us. To and can we get a sneak peek of artists collaborating? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. I have Techno on the project. I have Faust the Bad Guy. I have Ajebo sure. Hustlers. Timaya. I have Yeba Buluku Boys. Oh, oh wow. Oh, nice. I have Timaya. I have Alpha P. I have Victoni. It's a whole can lot I of hug you? Hey! 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 hey. <laughs> Only wow. I, have a, I have a song with Chris Brown. No! I have a Rihanna. No! I have a with Jay-Z. <laughs> oh, Jay, you are retired. All right, thank you so very much. Thank you so, thank much. so much. Thank you so much for having me. It was amazing having you on the show. Oh, thank you so much. And uh, that's all we can take right now with the interview. We've got Sochaville coming right up after this break, so don't go anywhere. <laughs>